project, please. Okay, I'm Tim Bookwalter, and I'm from Annandale, Virginia. And my project has always been a fan of the Phoenix missiles. I've flown just about every size, so I decided to do, do one for my level three. The big challenge was the nose cone. To get it heavy enough, I've actually got 10 1.25 pound weightlifter plates in it. Uh, for the, so the nose itself is over 20 pounds, and I can adjust that weight if I want to fly it on a lower uh, motor. Uh, this is the second flight on it. The first one was my successful L3 on an M1297. Today I'm flying on an M1760. So it should be a good flight. I'm looking forward to it. I got a, since it's a Navy missile, my Drogue and my Apogee are our typical uh, blue and gold Navy colors. So that matches the missile. And it's good that we're flying it on Memorial Day since, you know, it's a military theme. So how's that? Well, how high do you think it's going to go? We're going to get about 4,200 feet, plus or minus a little. And I noticed there's a, a Marine Corps emblem on your sleeve. Are you part of the Marine Corps? Yes, I was I was a former Marine. Yes, yeah, spent eight years in the Marine Corps. Well, thank you for your service. Thank you. All right, we're done. Thank you. Has dual deploy at 1,000 feet and with a backup at 500, it looks like. He has an AIM Anticor altimeter and an RRC2 Anticor. Or, no, sorry, altimeter. Anything else? Nope. You ready, Tim? This is a 10 count. Am I programmed? Okay. 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I don't know, those new blue thunders look purple to me. She's still whistling, handing well over the flight line to the left. Keep watching. There's an event. It looks like she got separated. Keep an eye on this one. Coming down, yeah. Keep an eye, left hand side. Heads up. Did she clear?